On ProShare Web Television, we bring you the details of the close of Nigerian stocks on a daily basis. Welcome to After the Bell at this moment. At the capital markets this Wednesday, stocks continue southwards movements to close down bids. While sell pressure abased the worth of equities, market breadth ended depressed as the small and medium capital stocks dominated the losers' board. We now take a look at the details. The All Share Index today dropped further by 0.61% to close at 19,829.29. The market capitalization also decreased by 38.34 billion naira to close at 6.25 trillion naira. The top trade has Dunlop Nigeria PLC from the consumer goods sector. The company traded a volume of 63.47 million units of stocks, while United Bank for Africa UBA, had 51.55 million units off, and Zenith Bank PLC traded 30.34 million units. The total traded stocks at the bourse was all valued at 1.13 billion naira. The five key sectoral indexes record the only appreciation in the insurance sector. By 0.24%, the sector closed at 147.88. Highest down movement was noticed in the banking sector, which diminished by 1.85%. And the gainers include Eternal Oil PLC, which closed at 3 naira 30 kobo against the earlier price of 3 naira 15 kobo. RT Brisco PLC gained by 4.27%, while UPL PLC closed at 3 naira 74 kobo. In the decliners section, Oando PLC leads with a decline by 4.98% to close at 24 naira 24 kobo. Diamond Bank PLC ended the day at 2 naira 50 kobo, while Bako descended by 4.79% to close at 1 naira 59 kobo. On the corporate declarations today, Unique Insurance PLC's audited results for the period ended December 31, 2010 shows a negative gross earning by 37.6%, while the profit after tax also slides down by 90.2%. Also, in its quarter 2 results for the period ended June 30, 2011, the gross earning of 1 billion naira is in the negative growth. Profit after tax depreciated by 70.4%. Finally, Ikaja Hotel PLC's quarter 3 result for the period ended September 30, 2011 scores both a negative sum of 5 billion naira and a negative amount of 826.8 million naira. For a comprehensive text version of this market report that has been made available for you on our news and features page. But in whatever situation you find your stocks, do continue to give it the long-term investment measures. This has been After the Bell for today. Join me next time for more.